New details tonight. We're getting our first look at the threats made on Snapchat that closed all schools in the East Valley District last Friday. The oldest of the three suspects, Mac Wilson, who you see here appearing before a judge today. He just turned 18 last month. He's being tried as an adult, while the other two minor suspects were taken to juvenile detention. We've learned some of the threats made in that group suggest shanking other students and bringing guns and lots of ammo to the high school. New on Nightside, what court documents tell us about the conversations that led deputies to arrest three students on felony charges? From Snapchat to county jail, 18-year-old Mac Wilson faced court commissioner Jeremy Schmidt. Conditions unreleased pursuant to CRR 3.2. Wilson, the oldest of three students arrested for threats made against LGBTQ classmates last week. But what he and no one has the right to do is to essentially plan and threaten violence. According to court documents, a member of the Snapchat group where the threats were made took screenshots of the messages. In them, several students suggest bringing shotguns, a hunting rifle, and pistols to an LGBTQ event at East Valley High School. When we cross over to actively um, threatening to cause a mass school shooting of an event at a school, doesn't it is truly one of the more serious scenarios we see. Spokane County detectives say Wilson posted a photo of what looks like a semi-automatic pistol with a drum-style high-capacity magazine in the group chat. Response to his interview with law enforcement was not that it did not occur, but that it was a joke. Wilson's dad pleading in court for his son's return, saying he's just a kid at heart. Mr. Wilson, being an adult at least in age, was also in a position where he was older and um, could instigate more action from the younger people involved with this. Wilson's bond is set at $100,000. Based on the extreme nature of this potential behavior, the concern for the schools and the community safety, the court believes the amount requested is appropriate. 